Now finding half steps with flats is just as easy as finding them with sharps. It's just slightly different. First, recall that the order of flats is the reverse order of sharps. B, E, A, D, G, C, F. You can remember that each flat is a perfect fifth below the previous one. But again, in the end, you're best off if you just memorize this order for quick recall. Now, if there's only one flat in the key signature, it changes B to B-flat, and B-flat begins a new half-step relationship with A, leaving C to wallow in pitiful loneliness a whole step away. Add a second flat, and another simple pattern takes shape. The last two flats will always connect with the notes directly below them to create our half-step pairs. Isn't that, again, very simple? Let's take a look at the rest of our flat keys. Also notice that when we add six or seven flats, that's C flat and F flat, to the key signature, it creates half steps between two flat notes. That's C flat down to B flat and F flat down to E flat. Now, you can easily find your half-step pairs for any key signature. Well, after a little practice, anyway, and it will become easy.